back to my channel, I'm Emily Lucy Ratch. If you are new here, I have got a TikTok, an Instagram, and now a YouTube channel with 6,000 subscribers, which is absolutely mad to me to think that I started this a month ago. So thank you so, so much to everyone who has subscribed and watched any of my videos. I appreciate you so, so much. Today, I'm not gonna have an intro, we're just gonna get straight into the video, and today's video is all about staple pieces to hide the tum. So, this is for any size, but preferably I'm going to talk about from my experience, which is a size 12 to 14 UK. So hopefully you'll get some good tips from this and let me know in the comments if you want to see more videos like this. Let's get started. Okay, so first of all, I'm going to talk you through some key bits that I'm going to pull out today as absolute staples that need to be in anyone's wardrobe who really has issues with the belly area. I absolutely swear by and pull out every single season without fail. If it's not this item, it is a very similar item, but either in a different print, different size, different shape. First one, if you follow me on Instagram or TikTok, you will have heard all about this Primark shapewear as I rave about it so much, to the point I've had managers from Primark message me telling me that they are sold out and people are coming in asking for these bodysuits because of me. So that is a massive, massive achievement on the shapewear front. But this, I swear by it so much, it is great to put under outfits such as these polka dot shorts which are also from Primark as an outfit together like this. You can either team it up with flat sandals or heels and a blazer like the one that I'm wearing here and have that as a day or night outfit. But this bodysuit I swear by, you can either wear it as actual shapewear or as I wear it as a top. It is an absolute gem. It's just so cheap, affordable and it goes with everything. Under anything it's just a key staple to have in your wardrobe. Next is a good pair of shorts. So these ones are from Primark and they were four pound. I have them in khaki, black and polka dot and these ones are in a size 14. But these ones are great because they are floaty. So if you're shopping online and you're looking for anything, this is one of the key words I'm gonna say to you and it is floaty. If you have big legs like me, stomach, or anything that you're trying to disguise in this area, or legs chafing together, anything like that, the word floaty is your friend. So definitely write that one down for when you are coming onto online stores and you want to search for something. Floaty shorts is a great one. They're so flattering and definitely something that you need in your wardrobe every summer. Next is a staple bodysuit. So this one is a double layered bodysuit from I at First. I have this one in blue, pink, white, black. It is such a good bodysuit. Because it's double layered, there's no nipple action happening. And sometimes I will wear the shapewear underneath the bodysuit. It is just such a great addition to throw on with anything. With this denim skirt, with some joggers, with trousers, white trousers it looks great with. I've got a picture here of me in that outfit. And anything, jeans, blazer, they're just ideal. And because they Instead of wearing a top that you have to tuck in, like right now I'm wearing a top, so if it rides up or down, it's gonna be uncomfortable, you're gonna see that's gonna add extra texture here. Wearing a bodysuit actually slims you down because it pulls you in the same way that shapewear does, and it creates that really nice slimline style. And also, it just goes with everything, and it's great for summer and winter because you can just layer them up. This is why I've got so many bodysuits because they just go with everything. They're so much better than any top. You just throw them on under skirts, under joggers, under jeans, anything. They go with everything every season. So these ones are a great buy in every colour that they have. Next is denim shorts. So these denim shorts, again, if you follow me on any of my other social medias, you will know that I've raved about these shorts from Boohoo. And the trick is, if you are like me, where you don't want your legs to rub together, I go to the tall section. The tall section for denim shorts is a godsend. I'm so sorry tall girls, and I know I've had a lot of stick on Twitter for sharing these about the tall section because you girls have it hard enough trying to get clothes. But why do brands have to make denim shorts so short? I do not know. So here's a way to, to battle it, is to go to the tall section and get a jean short that is in a longer leg and then it just fits perfectly. Cannot rate these jeans enough. If you're interested in these ones or any of the items, I've linked them all below in the caption. Next is a shirt dress. I did a post on my Instagram and TikTok about having big boobs. If you're a lady with big boobs and you don't know how to dress and you're wearing anything that's round your neck, up, up high, it's a no-no. So here is how to wear a shirt dress, no matter what size you are. 
I always wear them with a wrap belt like this so you can create a cinched in waist and then I'll team it up with a body underneath like this one which is lacy or you can get one that's just a plain white one, it depends what you want it to do but I like the lacy one and then I'll leave it like this and I'll tie it to the side. Here's a picture of me wearing it and that's how I like to style it. I just think it's so much more flattering than wearing a standard shirt dress that's buttoned down. Anything with buttons, girls, that's with our size is just really not gonna compliment you unless it's in the correct way. Size up, cinch it in at the waist and wear the lace bodysuit underneath and it will make such a difference. Honestly, this one for going out autumn, winter or summer, it is a really great staple piece. We've got wrap dresses. So wrap dresses I absolutely love. Anybody stomach area and no matter what you wear you feel self-conscious in if you are an apple shape And you feel like your weight is not distributed So as I mentioned at the start of this video, I feel like my top area of my stomach is a lot smaller than the bottom area of my stomach So I tend to show off that area and cinch it in at the waist there But if you're somebody who has a stomach that you feel like is not able to cinch in anywhere You want to be going for these style of dresses They go underneath the bust so you're creating a shape under here and then it's cinching you in at the waist and then the best part about it is they are layered. This one from Quiz is perfect. It's layered with a lining, so that's where your stomach's going to be. But then not only one, but two layers over the top, and then this nice ruffle detail to distract the eye from any unwanted belly area that you feel self-conscious about. And if you feel like everyone is going to be looking at you because you're wearing a dress, feel free to put a blazer over the top like this while you're walking into a restaurant or you're walking into a bar use it to cover up like this as long as you take it off when you sit down or stand up that is all that matters but I know firsthand how daunting it can be to try a new style and walk into a restaurant or a bar for the first time if you want to wear a blazer I'd go for one oversized like this and just hide a little bit of what you are maybe a little bit apprehensive of but these two styles this one's from Quiz and this one is from Boohoo and both of them have this really gorgeous wrap feature where they've got the frill down the front. If you search wrap into the website, loads of these different styles will come up and it is a great word to keep. So number two is wrap. Next we have the little black dress. So this one is perfect from PLT because it has the ruching detail. Word number three is ruching. Ruched, ruching, ruch. <laughs> Oh, all of those work within website to search and you will find loads of great dresses that you would not necessarily come across. Ruching is amazing. So this one and this one. This one's from Pretty Little Thing and this one is from ISO at First. Both of them are super flattering because of the ruching detail that they have down the side and the front. Disguising any tummy area with the ruching detail. So from ISO at First has the ruching detail and I absolutely love this one because it has the big puff sleeves and they're really in at the moment but this one is ruched on the front and the back which is great to make your bum look absolutely juicy so this one is a great piece as well and because it's white you might feel a little bit like it's a bit a bit too in your face but because again this is double layered it's not transparent the ruching detail is super flattering and I promise you you will be so shocked at how gorgeous you look in this style of dress then we have jeans so these jeans I've read about these again I'm a real Primark lover if you can't actually tell, but these ones are from Primark and they are high-waisted. I've had lots of girls message me and DM me on Instagram with different jeans, styles of mum jeans, balloon jeans, and they're wondering why they feel so rubbish when they're wearing them. And if you have got big legs like me, or big inner thighs, or a big lower tummy, or anything that you feel self-conscious around that area, adding volume to that area is not a good idea because it's gonna make you feel bigger than you actually are. So that's why I always go for a straight leg, a skinny, jean with a high waist always has to have a good stretch in it and as well we're all very guilty of wanting comfort over style so it's really really easy to go for a bigger size in jeans but then you're going to completely lose the shape and you're going to get that weird shape on your belly where you feel like it's not securing at all and you just feel unsupported and they're just falling off your bum that's not flattering so always go for the fitted size you need to actually like squeeze into them when you first put them on after washing them because give it an hour they'll be literally so stretchy again and they'll be hanging off so you need to make sure that they are fitted do not go for the bigger size in jeans make sure they fit you perfectly then i've already touched on it a little bit but blazers so this one is from missy empire and i did want to show you the white one but it's currently in the wash but this one's a black one from primark 
I go for oversized if I'm going to go wear something like this because I just want it to bring me in. If I'm wearing something on a night out and I want to wear a blazer and I'm wearing something quite fitted in heels, I'll always go for one that's a little bit tighter. So I'll show you an example of that. So this one is from Boohoo in a size medium. I would never put this over the shoulder because there is not enough fabric to go over. So it literally just ends up looking like it's too small. This one is one to be worn actually on your body and it's to create a tight shape if you want in a night out look. So this one's a medium, so I know it's gonna be tight on me. And then it just creates, I would never wear a baggy top like this with it, it would have to be a, a tight top, but it just creates shape instantly on my arms, it's flattering here. Another great tip is to always make sure if you are wearing anything baggy and you're trying to bring yourself in and not make yourself look like you're wearing too many layers and too big, is to always go for on the shoulder here so it needs to fit. Don't go anything that's got drop shoulder, it's gonna make you look bigger than you actually are. You want something that's gonna be on the shoulder here or on the neck here so it creates that narrow shape and fitted. And I don't feel uncomfortable in any way. It's obviously tighter and a lot smaller than the Primark one but it's just, it's meant to be that look, so it's perfect for a night out. So next is skirts. This one I absolutely love. Not only is it leather, but it's a wrap skirt as well. So this kind of detail, again, as I mentioned with the wrap dresses, is super flattering for our body shape. I have a really nice one that I've posted on my Instagram before, which is a beige one with a wrap detail from Boohoo. This one is from Pretty Little Thing. These ones are great staple bits to put with the shapewear or the bodysuit for a great quick outfit. Again, I'd put the blazer over the top, team it up, team it up with a big nice bag like this for a statement look. And we also have ruche skirts, which again, love the word ruching obviously, but this one is so good. I've put this on for, I've put this on my Instagram before for out, out looks with a blazer top. It's really, really flattering on the stomach area and you can get bloated and you won't be able to see because of the ruching detail. It is absolutely perfect. So, I know I've rushed past everything really quickly. I really whizzed through all of those outfits, but I just wanted to do a really quick run through of some ideas on how you can optimise online shopping to try and find staple pieces that you can bring out every single season without fail and are going to suit on your body shape. So the four key things to take from this video are Floaty shorts, bodysuits, wrap dresses, ruching. Use those four things when searching for online items and I promise you, you will find an outfit that will suit your body shape. I hope this has been really helpful. Please subscribe to my channel for more videos like this and if you haven't already checked out my Instagram and TikTok, please head over to at Emily Lucy Ratch and I'll be back for more things like this. Comment below to tell me if you want any more videos like this or if there's anything in particular you want me to answer any questions for. Thank you so much again for watching and have a great day.